Okay, so you know how whenever I start a WTS and I do a cold opening just like this, actually, let me double tap to make sure it focuses on my face while I do this. Uh, I do some random things, like completely random. I walk throughout the house. I literally just walked through the house for like maybe two minutes. I looked everywhere and I thought, what is something I can do with something else to be funny, basically? I found Cool Whip. And I have an idea. And here it is. Do you notice it? Do you see it? How about now? Right. Can't say this isn't turning you on. I'll do it more provocatively this time. I'm fucking 28 years old. What am I doing with my life? Oh, uh, there's still more there. Wow, it really stays. Oh my god, I missed a lot on this side. I'm ready to go. Hello guys, welcome to WTS 110. My name is Enrique Barrow 34 and guys, on this episode of WTS, we're gonna get to see some clips, okay? We're gonna get to see some clips. You're not just gonna sit there and watch me eat whipped cream off my nipples all fucking day, unless you want to. I mean, if you want to, I can totally fucking do that. Like, the whipped cream is still right here. Watch, look, 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 still here. You want to button down? But we shall be professional, move on, and not do that because that can be considered disturbing. On our first clip of WTS, we're doing something that we've never done before and we're going to do it first. Actually, we have done it before, haven't we? But we're going to do it again. Name that aim. Welcome to another edition of Name That Aim. Here on Name That Aim, we take a clip from a nub, slow it down, and show you just how exactly someone's bad aim can be. Now I know a lot of you guys don't want to be on Name That Aim. Why? Because I'm, I'm basically making fun of you. In fact, I am now purposely trying to find Name That Aim clips because I haven't done Name That Aim for quite some time and I want to bring it back. So I found this clip. This is definitely a Name That Aim. So as I take the bag Evan gifted me and place it on my head as such, let's watch the clip. Oh my god, that aim is horrible. I'm gonna give you 17.2 seconds to figure it out as we give you our weekly fatty cringe moments. Mom, don't watch this. Welcome back again to Name That Aim, Miss Cam. I should have shot that Twitch. <laughs> oh my just god. Lit up. Oh, oh that's gone, man. <laughs> Are you trying to one up your Dolga B clip? Because let me tell you something. You get pretty fucking good at it. <laughs> What's funny is I see you get kills on people more when they're actually challenging you than when they're not looking at you. Yeah. That you is like that person. <laughs> Yo, if you're face to face, let's go. But I'm shooting the back. For the next clip, I am actually going to do a magic trick. Because for this clip, I'm gonna make Misfit Chibis disappear. And woo! Now, in Rainbow Six Siege, do yourself a favor right now. Say the most important thing in that game to you. Is it bat knowledge? Is it the way you aim your gun? Is it your clutch potential? Is it knowing the gadgets better than anybody else? Now, I bet some of you are thinking right now the most important thing to you are callouts. Because a lot of our solo queue players will be the first to attest that callouts are huge. Once you get them, it's hard to not, you know, get them any longer. Does that make sense? Once you're actually used to a team calling out for you, it's hard to go back and play without it. And I would tend to agree and say callouts, yes. Number one feature in Rainbow Six Siege, you need callouts. And that's why every single day when I'm inviting people to play, there's only one person I look for. That is he he. I'm in bomb major. You have a rook. You have, you have a rook and a Jaeger. Rook and Jaeger. Jaeger done a headshot. Nice job, oh, guys. Oh, they never picked up the rook. Okay, they they didn't. Wow. The rook. All right. Sick. How was this not a headshot on it? He 
see he don't even want to tell me. He can see him for 30 fucking seconds, Jack. Hey! You have a mic! <laughs> what if I couldn't get him? <laughs> hey, if you tell me he's there, I'm not going to make myself vulnerable! <laughs> that sounds like a personal problem, my dude. Hey! You saw him for like good seven seconds! <laughs> I was trying oh, to aim God. at him. He was moving to the Can't you say I got a fucking game? Oh, man. <laughs> oh <laughs> my God. It's like the fact that oh you're feeling God. suicidal sounds personal. I don't think you should All you had to do <laughs> was say there's a Jaeger at Mark. Or I got a Jaeger at Exhibition peeking in. And then I wouldn't have peeked it because I know he's there. I would have said, oh, fuck. Oh, what do I do? You don't bro. tell me bro. shit. Damn it, <laughs> Hey, you not, can you not hold down the L trigger and talk at the same time? I can, but I have nothing to say, is what I'm saying. Nothing to say? <laughs> Motherfucker right here! <laughs> the reason I had to make Misfits Chibi disappear is because that was actually recorded three weeks ago for a different WTS, but that WTS was running long, so I had to cut the hee hee call out out of it. But look, they're back now. <laughs> gotcha. Nub of the week. I have found just enough clips to make this person not only a nub once before, but now a nub for the second time in a row. Can you guess who that nub is? If you can guess right now, I will give you this horse glue. It's really strong. Gorilla glue. Same same thing. Horse gorilla. Sodium, welcome back. What oh, barbed wire is, is this? <laughs> that is the worst barbed wire I've seen in my fucking life. What is that supposed to do? That's yours, Sodium? No, I don't watch it. Oh my god, I'm sorry. Come here. Oh, that's not Breed's bear, of course. Yeah. Oh, the drone Can't be Breed. The, the one time there? it's not Breed. I know, he keeps taking my valve. He's got eyes on him. He's got eyes on him. Oh. Bars. Oh my god. What? Oh my god. Those bars are ridiculous. Like melee, because you're trying to pre lean. What's Zenby? What's Zenby? Got a Ashley shot. Oh my god! Wow. Oh, oh my god. Oh, and this, this is, is why <laughs> you don't go nades. I should have went nades. They're not mad for fucking Get your shot. fat ass back here. Oh, what? oh, that's not a good deal. WTSV, you know me. Yeah, that's the intro for it. Go watch it. He's gonna do something with a fucking pistol, ain't he already? A bomb has been located by R4. That's fucking sh. Oh, I thought he was gonna hit that. Oh my! That man in the family! Oh! I didn't understand the cliff until then. I'm like, what is he doing? Oh my god. I wanna be a smushy, smushy. I wanna be a smushy, smushy. Control the three right now. You one on four remaining. Diffuser located. Do you get the last one? Wait, are you gonna pull it off? Huh. I just came. Also, oh, and also inside, uh, inside joke. But hey, when I saw that clip, Smushy, I screamed, "This is America!" What happened? Not really. Or maybe it wasn't it. We'll never know. I still don't get how that's a fucking joke. Look how red he is. Look how red he is! I don't even know what to say. Dude, fucking how many? He just got 80 points for fucking uh, Jaegers. That double! They're behind you? Op 4 eliminated. What? Is someone gonna fall through that hatch when you open it? Oh, please tell me that's what's gonna happen. Please tell me that's what's gonna happen. Thank you guys so much for watching WTS 110. Now, I'm gonna go over something really quickly that is not important, but something you want to know. 
I am going to have another WTS What the Strum Awards. We're going to have that party in a couple weeks. I've already gotten a few ballots thus far. If you want to vote for WTS for the WTS Awards like we did last year if you were here, in the description below, again, in the description below, it's going to have the 17, I think, categories listed in the description below. Go ahead and email me what you want to go ahead and nominate for. And I'm also going to give you an example. Let's say if I was voted on for MVP of the year, basically clutch player of the year, but I do not fill out a ballot, I will not take me in consideration. So does that make sense? If a person who does not fill out a ballot wins an award, that person does not win an award, I'm going to go to the person who has the most votes who did fill out a ballot. So again, if you want to have your opportunity at winning an award, it's not really that big of a deal, but it's kind of cool. If you want an opportunity at winning the award, go ahead and fill out the ballot. If you're someone who mostly lurks in the channel, doesn't play that much, don't think you're gonna win an award, still go ahead and fill out that ballot. We have a lot more votes, have a lot of fun. If I don't get enough votes, we'll go ahead and skip it this year, but we got it last year, so hopefully we can get it this year. That was a lot of talking and now I'm tired. Fuck off. Hey guys, make sure to check out all my things in the description listed below. Oh my fucking god. Okay, so we're at the end of WTS. It's that moment where I look for something again to do. And fuck, there's a loud car outside. I found this sore throat spray. I'm not sick one bit. And... It's amazing how bad that tastes, dude. Smells nice. I found new deodorant. It actually smells nice. Holy shit. Ladies, you want to fuck? Whoa. I mean, 